Growing up, I was pretty inquisitive about how a lot of things worked, which is probably why that led me to do architecture. I'm just going to take some model photos of this model I built from a capstone. So that's going to be right around there. And I was really into art and drawing and just creating things, so it just worked out pretty well. I'm on my way to class, or to work, and then I'll be heading to class right after, so it's, it's going to be one of those busy days. Being in the financial aid office, I was also offered photo work study, which was how I was able to you know, make money to actually pay for my expenses while I was in school. So I'm just starting my shift, I'm ready to just help out the next person in line. Hi. How can I help you? I have some questions about my finances. I get a lot of incoming freshmen who are like, oh my god, how are we going to pay for school? Because they come in either with just student loans or maybe um, their parents aren't able to help them out, but they really want to come here. Even if you came to the U of A without a scholarship, and from an out-of-state student perspective, if you put in the hard work, your college and your own dedication can actually create those scholarship opportunities for you. Sophomore year, my college actually gave me a scholarship just based off of how I was doing in my classes. That was a pleasant surprise because I wasn't expecting that at all. I always encourage people to use Scholarship Universe, which is a place where a lot of students can apply for multiple scholarships based off of what they're most likely to get. So there's thousands of scholarships, and a lot of it is students just need to apply for it, and chances are you'll get it if you put in the time and effort to actually apply for it and invest in your education. For me, I've had to do both. I'm taking out loans and I also have my scholarships, but on the weekends and even during school week, I'm going to work and putting in that effort to make sure that I can live comfortably while I'm going to school. I just got off work and now I'm heading to class. The work-life balance is pretty tough. Once you actually start working and have school going, you can have a better understanding of what you're actually able to do realistically. So I'll be here for the rest of the day in the studio. It gets pretty hard, but they're also understanding that you're a student first, so it does make a difference.